Hi, and welcome back to Let's Play Disciples 2. I think, ooh, I probably should put him on the front row first. Because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need more damage output against this guy. Ouch. Yeah, this will be a bit tough. Now, where... This is probably a good place to start. Um, he's useless. He's doing 70... Yeah, he's doing 138. Okay, so the white is going to attack this angel. Angel takes some damage, loses a level, and loses quite a bit of damage. Now hopefully, I can survive this. 127 damage there. Nice. I think that extra damage is what saved us, or at least saved my Warlock. Because otherwise the Marksman would have survived and killed him. So I think that was probably the best thing I could have done. That's fine. So he's doing 70 damage. This should take him down a level. Loses... Ooh, wow, he loses 15 damage. This is why the white is amazing. All that extra... Because he does extra damage because they're losing... Ooh, nice. Extra Wraith. Um, because they're losing HP when they drop a level, but they also lose extra damage that they do. And hopefully we can get... An, ooh, life potions. Awesome. Lot of good stuff there. Lot of good stuff. So... <laughs> I think I'll just use both of those. Get him back up to speed. And... You know what? I might just... Hire another Wraith, or Initiate, rather. Actually, hold on a second. Um, I'd like to y at least use one of these in one mission. So I probably should do it in this one, if I can. Oh, there's treasure up there. I'll leave it for Brian, though. Um, yeah, I think... That's a thief. It's a waste of time. Spearman. Swap him back here for now. Just for the moment. He'll be back on the front row soon. Yeah, I'd like to get at least one of those um, Doom Drake upgrades in my party on this mission, maybe one in the next mission, and then never use them again sort of the plan because they're not that great especially compared to what I can get oh come on guys leave my stuff alone alright what I'm gonna do here is hire a thief because I need to find out what's here before I just dive into it so I'll infiltrate spy. That's easy, that's easy. This will be a bit difficult. As will that. Oh yeah, he's an Empire unit. This will be tough. Mountaineers. Ice Giant will be a bit difficult. But we can handle it. So I think I'm just going to sit here and kill things for a while. get some much needed experience and start to you know bring them down a level they're a bit too dangerous still encroaching on my territory all the time and hopefully that thief can uh, 
keep alive long enough to get a spy into the Empire army as well. So I can see what all of this is about. I'm hoping he'll run away. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. Beware, the Mountain Clan's High King is furious. He will fight until death. Something has angered him greatly. We must accomplish Mortis's quest as quickly as possible. Huneria must fall. Ah, uh, they are right. So I should do something about... I need to save the experience for my Dreadworm, though. Yeah, it'll only take a turn to get over there. Let's just do it. Get it over with. Sack all of this stuff for the moment and come back to it. He can't reach that. So we'll just throw him in here. Or maybe I could send him to the shop. Wasn't there a potion in there that I wanted? I guess we'll find out. Um, yeah, so let's head back here, get our dragon back. Uh, maybe do without the shade for the moment. I do like having that wraith. No, we'll go with the shade. Paralysis is much more useful. That's okay, I can take that. I don't really need life mana at all, but I'll take it anyway. Maybe save up for a big spell. Let's see what we got over here now. That'll be pretty easy. Okay, so now let's bring him back, get her in there, keep him in here for the moment. Might bring him back into my party later. It's nice having some flexibility. Mortis has whispered once again, Our almighty goddess will raise corpses to aid us to vanquish the allied armies. Oh wow, good thing I came over here. Rise, Mortis' children, and explore the realm. Now this could help out a lot. Um, they're just a couple of zombies, but if they've got extra leadership, I can throw that wraith into there and do some serious damage to some other um, units. Now, the big problem here is that spider. I think I'll let the skeleton warrior take it, because he should level up. Um, I do have to build the structure first, though. It's 1,500. Yikes. Maybe should have stopped at the shop. That's... That's okay, though. We can... We can just deal. We'll switch him to the back later if we need to. And hopefully... He's level 2. He's level 2. So I can damage them a little bit by draining a level. So we lost a good 40 health there, and hopefully some damage, yeah, he's doing 130. So 165 isn't bad. And we got the double paralysis, so we're really well set up to take this out. Really glad I took the shade with me. I should be able to take these out next turn, no problem. The white is actually one of my favorite units. <clears throat> it doesn't do as much damage as um, these guys will do, the uh, Arch Lich, but uh, I really like that drain level attack. 
it does so much for you. Especially once you get up to those, uh... Yeah, they've only got one leadership. Especially once you get up against, like, the Ice Giants. Perfect for them. So, we'll just... I guess we'll just keep them around. Maybe a zombie and a wraith combination for one of them. Oops, that's not what I wanted. There we go. And the other one can go hide out in this city, I suppose. Just to slow anybody down that tries to steal it. They'll probably get it no problem, but it's not a big deal. Now, what have I got in terms of gold? I don't think I have quite enough. We'll find out soon, though. This is okay. They're not really doing much, actually. And I will be able to make it over there soon. Oh, that kind of sucks. I don't like losing my gold. But I should be able to take it back fairly quickly. That's okay. 250. Yeah, I've only got 1250, so I have to wait one more turn. And he will level up, or would have leveled up with this battle. Oh well. Should have sold some items first. That's okay. That was easy enough. And we can drain a level from him. And then defend. I like the immunity to poison. Definitely helps out. And we should be able to handle that with no worries. Oh, he almost leveled up as well. Shucks. I should have been paying more attention. I could have gotten him to the next level there. I'll just build the structure now. Because I've got the money for that one at least. Then the next small battle I get into. You fall into trap. We feast on your flesh now. Oh. Huh. <laughs> well, she's going to die. Horribly. Really powerful parties over here. Silver ring. Living armor. Not bad, but I could have done better. Now here, I think they have that potion. Yes, I want that. Didn't work out for me. That's okay. I'll probably just buy it later. A couple of guys moving forward here. And you're dead, so we'll watch it happen. I wonder if they're gonna, like, move around and kill some of the mountain clans now. It would be nice, but I don't think it'll, it'll happen. They'll probably just sit there. Eh. Yeah, I'll kill them. Quickly. More gold lost. Wonderful. This is why I wanted to stay in the area, but I also really wanted to clear out the left side of the map first. And get my Doom Drake back. Yeah, it looks like they are going to go after the uh, Mountain Clans a little bit, which is awesome. Get a little bit of help in that regard. I still don't have a temple, actually, so I'll just have to keep going. And... Uh, I'll just go to the shop first. There we go. Because I can sell those items. Because I have a bunch. Get 
get rid of him. Should be able to take out the angels as well. Depending on what they've got in their party. And then from here we can just attack the orc. For the small bit of experience that he will give. And level up our skeleton and doom drake that way. It's a little bit better than going for one of the bigger battles immediately. And then from here we can slowly work our way back, killing off all of their units. Especially the rod planters. I am just sick of them. Well, they didn't plant anything, which is good. And now they're close by, I can deal with them with Brian. The thieves I'm not worried about at all. Those ranger units are a bit of a hassle. Mostly because they'll be taking kills from me, which is experience. Kind of helps out, I guess. Okay, so let's get this gold. We're definitely going to sell the ruby. And gold ring and silver rings. And I think we'll... Yeah, we'll have enough. So I think I'll keep all the scrolls. They do come in handy. Stone Rain, the Orb of Healing, I'm not going to use. And I think that's it. Yeah, we'll keep that, I suppose. Don't have enough for that if I also want to build the Vault of Souls. So we'll do that. And then, attack one of these two. Oh, we can't quite make it. Ah, darn it. Well, we'll be able to get them next turn anyway. One of these zombies should do for any that'll get away. I don't know if I can handle him. I think he's got a warrior. Which might be a bit difficult, but we'll go for it anyway. And just see what happens. Eh, yeah, that's not bad. Very close to losing it, but we survived, barely. And then his other unit will have to kill my zombie to get through, which will slow him down a bit. These two, one of them will probably plant a rod but it should be easy enough to take back. This I like. I like when the other races spend money on improving the city, because it means I don't have to. I just fight to get it back and reap the rewards. Okay, that's nice. I can kill both of them without uh, any casualties, so to speak. Oh, and he'll just try to run around, which will slow him down even more. It's perfect. So let's get these two out of the way before we do anything else. There we go. Now this is a much better team. Because he has uh, 110 damage, which is great. And this is 55, or actually 60 rather, to everybody. So this will be a lot better. And then we'll just go through the motions of killing this one. 
And then, who do I... I only need a structure for him, I think. The rest are fully leveled. At least as far as we can get them on this mission. So, that is fine. Oh, he's not going to be able to do anything, really. So, bring him back to the capital, I suppose. Sounds reasonable. And... I suppose we'll just end the turn. Not much else to do. Although I think we still have to focus our efforts on killing the last one or two rod planters in the area before I hire another banshee. Just to make sure. I think there actually is only one left. And it's that guy. So... That'll be really quick and easy to do. <laughs> She's just gonna go get herself killed. Awesome. Alright, and that's that for this episode. So thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.